Absolutely. Fully Natty verified. Check approved, baby. Good check mark. Daddy's here. Big Daddy Natty. <laughs> Big Daddy Natty. Let's go. Freaking Monday. Well, for me it's Monday. For you, it's probably not. I got a I got a hat yesterday. Cause I'm a Colorado Rocky baby. That's what I am. I'm also a Fairweather fan, so that's cool. Um, <laughs> you think that's funny, Taylor? Yeah. Uh, yeah. A little bit. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm going to do upper body. I had my full deal of week last last week. Um, a lot of cool things are coming. Uh, greens juice for create your nutrition. Ah, oh, shit. I just spilled the beans. I'm um, also creatine HCL. You already know your boy takes that shit every single motherfucker. Day, you feel me? Why are there so many stickers on these hats? You ever notice that like there's just way too many stickers? Well, you gotta, you gotta put it on there. You're like, you're like, yo, let me grab this one on. You walk outside, you have a sticker. Someone's like, huh, hey, what a loser. And then I'm like, yeah, that's me. Um, but yeah, I went to the mountains this past weekend. I went into, um, come with me. I went to, uh, to Vail. And Vail was probably one of the most epic places that I've ever been to. Just, there's so many different people. Oh, wow, I'm looking hot. Real sexy. And it was just like one of the most incredible experiences I've, I've ever been a part of. And I went with my, my friend Marissa, that was really fun. Um, you guys have no clue who she is. That's cool, oh well. Uh, and today, what I wanna do is I'm gonna, I'm gonna go train up her body. We're gonna get a fucking intense workout in. Um, but at the same time, I wanna talk about this Natty Verified movement that's going on. That's kinda, um, I have my own take on it. And I do respect Greg Gallagher. But at the same time, actually not, I'm not gonna use the word but. And at the same time, I'm gonna give my full honest opinion on the situation and everything that's kinda been going on. So uh, yeah, without further ado, let's drink this freaking creatine HCL and green juice. Mm, Cause that's what we do, baby. Mm, October 5th, be prepared, let's get it. By the way, I'm on 250, 250 carbs, 220 protein, and three grams of fat, <laughs> 85 grams of fat. I'm a fucking shredded box. That's what they call me out here on the streets. Let's seriously get the workout in. Also, um, aside from the greens and the creatine HCL, I also take um, like, a, like a stress product. I take vitamin C, liposomal. <laughs> liposomal. Um, I also take a probiotic. I forgot to tell you. Beep, beep. Uh, probiotic, um, I take zinc as well. I also take my vitamin B12. I also have uh, a couple things for Daniel, but we're not gonna get into that. Daniel's like, you know, we don't, we don't fuck with the other cats, only Daniel. So uh, we'll, we'll get something for him a little later, but uh, yeah, that's what I do. I think you guys know that, but I wanna make sure that you know how serious I am about every time, you feel me? All right. You might be thinking like, I'm not generally like this. Am I like this all the time? Yeah. Yeah, pretty fucking weird. Um, all right, let's get this workout in. Bow, baby! Brad, Brad Castleberry, yeah, let's go. It's time to eat, baby. We're not talking about food, we're talking about weights. Okay, so what we're gonna be doing is uh, running through I'm, I'm looking for five sets of five. Remember, like, if, you, if you've been watching me in the, in the past episodes, I haven't even been able to do this. I, I was doing it for like three, so I want to do five sets of five with this now, which means I'm getting stronger even though I'm cutting down, which is really cool. And then I'm going to go over and hit five on the, uh, what are you pointing to? You don't even know where you're going. We're going to be doing five wide grip pull-ups with two 45-pound plates. So, again, I was only doing seven reps with a 45 plate. I feel stronger. I feel like I'm able and capable to go a little bit heavier. And then we're gonna get into the Natty Verify. Shit, yeah, and let's go. Okay. 
I got. That's it. <laughs> I'm very surprised what I did. Five sets of five with the incline. And then here, I wasn't, I only got like three and a half in the final set, which is totally fine, but burning out. It's like really going to the edge of where I can go. You know what I'm saying? Fuck. Next superset, let's go. I <laughs> fucking push it. <laughs> Remember? Easy work. I couldn't even get got seven out there. That's how you know how burnt I am. But we're gonna keep rolling. Let's get it. That's it. Definitely no more. Fuck no. So, what I'm gonna do now, this week, I have four sets of, or four rounds of, as hard as possible, cardio. And so I'm gonna go do that now. You know, a lot of breath. I'm trying to really exert myself on another level. Just keep on hustling. Get the right nutrition in my system and be ready October 5th. Because I started the day that I started dieting it was the day I was hopping on stage. Simple as that. I've never been in the sport. I have no clue about it. All I know is about the posing a little bit more. One thing I know from where I come from is from A to Z, I always put every ounce of effort in every single second. It doesn't matter if it's game day or if it's practice, it's there. In the classroom, it doesn't matter. And that's the mentality you gotta have. Let's get this cardio in. Five seconds, we're going full speed. Last minute. This is where you fucking win. Straight up. Challenge me. I dare you. 
It's the heart of a warrior. Nothing's too hard. Nothing's easy. I feel like puking. It's all about the mindset. Ten seconds. Come on, Brennan. Five, four, three, two, one. So, that's what you, that's what you get. Rest, relax. 212 calories burn in 10 minutes. That's how you know you're working. All right, what we're gonna do, we grab something to eat, show you my meal. And let's talk about this Natty Verified stuff. That's right. So, Natty Verified. I'm actually eating really quick after my workout. I have six ounces. So, recently, I've been wanting to eat uh, a little bit of smaller meals and like increasing the frequency. So the quantity has definitely changed a little bit, but I have some sriracha on here. I never used to eat any sriracha. I have salmon, six ounces, and then I have a cup of white rice, and then I have uh, six ounces of broccoli. When I have a lot of meetings, which are Mondays, I, again, I'm, I have a lot of businesses that I work with uh, that I've built, and I'm super excited to keep on working with them and, and building them. So it takes a lot of time, it does. So basically, I work with Icon Meals in a way where I just freaking get all these meals and consume them. <laughs> it's literally it, brother! It's literally it, creature you chill. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, I wanna talk about this Natty Verified. This Natty Verified movement. So I, I, I don't know if it's blown over yet, but whatever. Bodybuilder, freaking a massive uh, jug. What, it's whatever, it's like fucking bring it to dinner. I like going with my family, I'm just like, hey guys. <laughs> it's time to drink, baby. It's time to eat. Uh, so, Natty Verify, my opinions. So, a couple, a couple weeks ago, I talked about Christian Guzman, and I, and I gave my honest opinion. That's my honest opinion. I actually think that Christian, the way he shows up is incredible. Actually, it's magical. The majority of people do not show up in that way. He trusts that whenever he, he gives any information or um, anything, he, he, just, he just trusts the other, other people in his life, which is really, really cool. Allows his business to grow. Now with Greg O'Gallagher, so I'm we're kind of friends that we haven't we haven't chatted in a, in a very long time. I have nothing negative to say about him. Uh, he um, I don't know if he has anything negative to say about me. I don't think we've never really had beef or anything like that. I've always been inspired by the way he does business, and he's also partnered with a couple different people, um, and one of them I'm actually friends with. And so I've I've kind of seen the evolution of his business from the outside perspective, but also knowing a little bit more uh, about what's inside, just because I know a couple people that, that work with him. And it's it's incredible. He's built an incredible business, and not just tooting his horn. Like, if you, if you guys see it, he's very good at marketing. His whole team's very good at marketing. They put the funnels together perfectly, the surveys, everything. Trust me, I know, I've researched it, I've, I've studied it, because it, it's great. If it works, don't try and change too much because it doesn't need to be fixed. And so, when I heard about this Natty Verified, it was very interesting, um, because from my perspective, and again, this is my opinion, and I never push any opinion on anyone else, it's not a fact. My opinion is that this is a great marketing tactic, 100%, this is fucking gold. When you go and you, you say, hey, I wanna do this Natty Verified movement and I wanna do all these different things, I wanna test everybody, all, like whatever. Like, to be honest, I don't truly believe he cares too much about other people being natural or not. I don't think he does. Um, and again, that's an opinion. He can say otherwise and I'll be like, oh, okay, that, my opinion stated at that point. You know, so uh, it's a great marketing tactic. It's a way to bring eyes. It's, it's a great way to to, to sell more product, to sell more programs. Um, he has a great following, a very diehard following. He has incredible programs that have worked for a very, very long time. And using his Natty Verified Movement and creating a documentary, because he has a great team behind him as well, it opens up a lot for him and the growth of not only 
his company, but his relationships. And that's key is that, you know, they say that your network is your net worth. And for him, it's been a little bit different because he's built things more so on uh, with his own team and everything that he's done. And now as he branches out more and more, and obviously you've seen him on ads, you've seen him across all social media, um, this is a huge opportunity. Now, do I agree that people should not with him about how people that claim Natty should 100% take a test and, and, and prove that they're wrong? Yeah, I, I do. I do in some ways, shape, and forms, I don't know why I had to say the whole thing, but at the same time, I don't really give a fuck, you know? And to be honest, I just don't give a shit. I don't care because the fact of the matter is I'm working towards something and what I'm working towards doesn't affect someone else. Yeah, other people like that are claiming natural are going to affect kids and all of that, right? But how do we, how do we combat that? We become the best version of ourselves and we show them what it is looking like to be natural, right? I'm 100% natural. And as I'm natural, I'm going through the process, the full days of eating, the prep, the bodybuilding, the whole thing to show you, hey, this is what's possible. And I'm gonna keep on saying like, hey, I wanna win natural. I wanna win amateur Arnold natural. And a million people might say, you're a fucking lunatic, whatever, you can never do that. But I wanna stay true to that. That's how we make a difference. Will it be cool if all these guys did the, did the uh, it's called the isotope, isotope test or whatever? Be great, but you can't catch them when they were t when they were taking stuff, when they weren't taking stuff. Like hormones change, uh, like as time goes on. So there's so much that's a that's a part of it. It's very hard. At the same time, you know, people like Matt Ogus, um, Julian Smith, uh, like multiple people have, have said, "Hey, I'm down to do the Natty Verified." And now that I'm prepping, and this is the very interesting thing. When you start prepping for a show and you, you start to realize what it takes, number one, what it takes, and number two, what it truly looks like to be natural and prep for a show, it's a complete different story. When you look at someone that's on gear or taking something, Tren, Clen, those are the only two that I really know to be honest. Tren, Clen, Tren hard, Clen hard, Clen easy. <laughs> then yeah, you're, you're, you're not gonna be a big daddy natty, you're not. <laughs> But, but like you see it, you see it and you're like, that guy's not fucking natural. There's no way. Like Julian Smith is natural. Like I can, I can honestly say it. I can see it. I can see how his body transforms and stuff. Matt Ogus, he's natural. I can see how his body transforms. Brian DaCosta, he's natural. It's insane. But like, the, like when you really, really see it and how long it takes for them to diet down, it's a completely different story. So with that being said, Natty Verified Movement, <laughs> cool and all, I think there's a lot of holes in the, the movement itself. Uh, it's a great opportunity for him to take his next level in, in, in making more moolah and really getting out there and, and bringing a lot to a lot of eyes to Kino body. But with all with all respect, like I could say fucking amazing job, like very smart. It's very smart and I have nothing bad to say about Kino body. So uh, yeah. That's all I got. I'm going to eat and then I actually want to show you a little bit more of my day. So Taylor is going to going to kind of play a little bit behind the scenes. A lot of people have been asking me about my businesses. You know, when I came back from all my injuries and I started the CFA, that's all I was doing was business, business, business. I don't want you guys to feel overwhelmed and I don't want you to, to kind of get this bad vibe of like, oh, Brennan's only about business. That's all he does. But the truth is I own many, many businesses, eight plus. And if they're not just like little small businesses that I'm like, eh, like, yeah, like, they're doing well. So come along for the ride, enjoy my eating, and yeah, let's have a good week. Yeah, let's go. Okay, so then, I'm, then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna put this on my wonder list today, and I'm going to. Yeah, man, very excited, yeah. Dude, we have some big shit, like, talking to some big influencers. It's like way lower than anything else, that's pretty huge right there. Yeah, and I just think we have a, a prime opportunity to make a dent in the industry, you know? Yeah, I like that we're doing, uh, you know, we're, we're setting ourselves up for true success so that we're not dependent on just one or two or five or two. He's super fucking smart. He's a super hard worker. We're gonna do black. We're gonna do black. That's fine. It's, that's gonna be really cool. Uh, we have a black design that we're getting printed up, Is that, if that's even possible. It's way possible. The other thing is, too, is since your stuff is boggling this week, I am going to ship you a box of the stuff so you can start working on your own feedback too. 
So I want to adjust uh, that copy that we have already and let's adjust it more, more towards me. So that's number one. That's like the first thing that, that we need to start getting done. So I haven't been able to oh, relax yet, take a shower or anything after the gym. I'm like really big on the cleanliness of myself. But now we have a call with my well, entire support team. Um, so yeah, so we only have a couple of minutes. Let's just chat over kind of everything that's happening. So just so you guys know, we're launching Create You Nutrition. A lot of things have happened over the past couple of days. Um, do you believe in the vision of the Create You? You all in? Completely. You taking care of business? You. Yeah. Good. Please be on time and set the standard for everybody. You got it? Yep. Sweet. I'm, I'm, and I'm happy that you're on the team. <laughs> Hell yeah. Sweet. I'm glad you're on board. We're about to have some fun. We're about to grow. We've all decided that it's better to just have everything under one umbrella. That's going to be with each person's business, it's gonna be their own business. So you're done with this, or you're coming back from the from a workout, and you're like, oh, I, gotta go, I gotta go and support, whatever. But think about the big vision. Think it looks look good on the packaging. Oh, so okay. think of something like, not just like short words, like, hey, we make shit happen. You know what I mean, like, it, that would work. I'm gonna ask her to please review it fully. Uh, and actually, I'll send it to you so you can send it via Wonderlist. Okay. Right. If that's cool with you. Yeah, whatever you want to do. Cool. So I'll, I'll send that over to you in a second. This It's actually really, really well written. Like it's really a baller. All right. Really cool. All right guys, so what I'm eating is, after all those freaking meetings, Lord of mercy, I have ground turkey with asparagus. I have three tortillas. These freaking tortillas are baller as F, man. Like, look at these. Quinoa flour gluten-free tortillas. So I can basically have one tortilla is 100 calories. So I'm gonna have three tortillas, and look how much food is here. I feel like I haven't eaten in months, and this is gonna literally fill me up. So, yeah, I wanted to show you kind of behind the scenes. I wanted to give you the Natty Verified spiel, all of that. Thanks so much for tuning in. Look how beautiful it is right now. Look at this. Jesus. You, what's funny, brother? Nothing, dude. You know, brother, brother. Wash, wash the dishes, brother, hanging out, you know? Brother, what is funny, brother? Just, just hanging. And uh, yeah, so thanks for tuning in for another episode of uh, Bodyweight to Bodybuilding. Stepping on stage October 5th. Again, super excited for that. Uh, I was on a couple calls today. People were helping me with posing. I don't want to show everything, and you know, I gotta keep some things secret. But uh, yeah, Create Your Nutrition's coming out. Greens Juice, uh, the Creatine HCL. I'm fucking hot, brother. Yeah! Anyways, uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. Remember the podcast every Tuesday and Friday. Yeah, yeah. Friday. Uh, every Tuesday and Friday. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you next time. Peace.